everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel and in today's video and in today's episode of chess adventures we will be playing another game of chess you already know what's happening here you already know the drill but this is just for somebody who may be new here even though chess adventures is a pretty uh, self-explanatory name for these series but in case, you know, in case if somebody doesn't get it, I have to say it. So today we'll be playing some three minute games once again, because it's funny, it's funny. I blunder a lot and it's just very crazy when I play three minutes. So that's why we'll be doing it, because I see that you all really, really love me losing my mind in three minute blitz games and blundering all of my pieces. I saw one comment Somebody told me, like, you didn't blunder your bishop, you gambited it. And it's just crazy, that's true. So from now on, there are no blunders, I'm just gambiting all of my pieces, okay? I gambit my queen. So <laughs> let's get straight into this, let's go. Uh, let's find the victim here, and let's hopefully crush their soul. Um, guys, to yesterday, I worked at the bar once again. It was so good. We had live music. Uh, my colleagues were singing. I was dancing at the bar, singing with the guests. It was so nice. I also got some tips. I got four euros just because I picked up guests' uh, glasses from the table. And I was like, you know what? Fine. Thanks, I guess. So it was crazy. And I really, really like it. I really like it. But today I had to go back to my ordinary work in the restaurant. And I talked to the bosses there. And I was like, uh, you know, um, I want to transfer. I want to I wanna go. Uh, I want to go to the bar. And they were like, oh, really? But we're kind of an understaffed here, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, I don't care. I will literally then quit. I will, I will fire myself, I guess, because uh, I don't want to work here anymore. I don't want to do it. I have to go back with my horse. This is kind of embarrassing, but fine. Because, uh, like, I don't care. I don't care even if I lose my paycheck. I don't care about it. I really do not care. I won't do work where somebody will treat me literally like shit. Excuse my language, everyone, but that's just how it is. Uh, today, I went on my shift in the restaurant at like 8 a.m. And my uh, job there is like like a plate picker, I guess. I'm just helping out, you know, with the plates. And my, my main job is like to pick up dirty plates and bring them to washing, okay? Oh, which, with which pawn should I take this? I think that this one is... This one shouldn't be it because they can kick my horse, right? So I think this one would be better. Uh, so I, I need to pick up, you know, dirty stuff and I can take this. Uh, and <clears throat> after I do that, uh, I bring them to the washing, uh, to the guys that are washing the dishes. And, you know, I just, I just let them wash it. It's, it ain't anything spectacular. Okay. And I uh, left. I will take this pawn, actually. I uh, left uh, some, like, dish where it's supposed to go. And the dude who was washing dishes was so angry at me because I put it, like, five centimeters to the right instead of to the left, uh, which is just, like, insane. And he started yelling at me, telling me, oh, I will push C5, uh, telling me, like, why? Why the fuck did you do this? <clears throat> this is crazy and i was like wait what what are you even talking about what i mean fine but like what and then he started throwing plates the dude literally he got so angry at me because i oh i have 58 seconds i'm speaking too much but it does not matter he literally started throwing plates and yelling at me because i put the dish a little bit to the right so he cannot reach the dish I was shocked, okay? I, I told him, bro, you have hands. That's what I told him. Because, like, what else I should have... What, what else should I have told him, you know? I can't even speak proper English anymore. Like, bro, you have hands. You literally have hands. 
and you're here uh, telling me like yelling at me because of that I can I couldn't believe it so you know I I can do this I can give them a check and get the bishop maybe baby oh let's go this is a nice fork oh my god oh my god let's go the queen the the rook the everything because if he takes my rook I take his rook as well Oh, but he, he decided not to. Fine, fine. I will go here now. Oh my god. But I only have 32 seconds because I speak too much about my private life. I really, really love spilling tea. Okay, guys. Okay. Maybe I can mate him in 30 seconds. I don't know. It really depends. I just really, really have to check him all the time. That's the deal. I have to check him. I really, really have to check him. Is this mate? No, it's not mate. Oh my god. But I, I think I'm getting close to it. Oh, oh, oh. Shh. Shoot. Oh, can't go there. I can go here. No, I blundered my queen. Oh, no, 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 so I will just let the time run out. That's the Sigma Grindset mindset. Sigma Grindset mindset right there. But I had such a good position. Oh my god, that fork. Oh, this was so cool, guys. I have to go back to, to show it to you once again. Oh my god, look at this. Because this was here, this rook. I could have easily just put in this. Forked him double because I, I give him a check. I attack the bishop and at the same time I attack the queen. And if, I mean, he, I don't know what he could have done here. So, of course, he moved. I got this. And even though now, like, my rook is hanging, uh, it's not actually because I can just take back the freaking rook. And I'm plus nine, plus eight, actually, but it's fine. But here, uh, I don't know why my opponent decided to take my bishop. Because my bishop was just too strong. But I had no time. I literally had no time. So, I mean, what can I say? I started screaming, okay? We will play another one. I just, I have five blunders. One missed win. Here I have mate in three, mate in two. And then mate in five. Oh, shoot. What is mate in two? Oh, maybe here? Wait. Oh, and then he has to go here, right? And then after that, I do what? What? I don't know. Please let me know in the comments down below if you know what is mate in two here. I think that the next move should be queen here, but after that, what's the mate? Please let me know in the comments down below. I'm going to grab some Red Bull. One second, please. Uh, this is like an ad break, so buymeacoffee.com slash sapatsapeti for donations for everyone who wants and can donate. Cheers. Oh, what a crazy game. Oh, what a crazy game. I really love being in 400 rating. This is crazy. Oh, let's go. I noticed that every time that they play chess... Oh, England Gambit. X I will win this one. Uh, every time that I play chess on my videos, first round is with the black pieces, second round is me with the white pieces. Every single time it happens like this. I will just... Yes, I will just take this. I mean, look at his king. Widely opened. Widely, widely opened. Yeah. I will put my other horse here so that I can push e4, not e5. I can't push e5. It would be cool if I if I could. But he sees right through this. So we'll push e3 then. Fine. Jesus. What a pushy guy. Janbiti. Janbiti. What is this name? Janbiti. We will unpin ourselves because we don't like being pinned. But yeah, um, see, now I can easily, easily, easily uh, just, what should I even do here? Wait, what is he attacking? I think I can go here with my bishop. 
I don't know, guys. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm quitting my job definitely because it's too much freaking work and uh, the work itself is not such a huge problem. Uh, it's the problem with the colleagues, with the constant disrespect. This person is giving me a pawn. Fine, we'll take this. Actually, no, we won't. And you know what? I feel like castle and queen side, but not just yet. We'll first kick this. Um, but yeah, I wanted to say that I'm definitely quitting my job because I won't be disrespected. Okay, guys, I don't know if you all had or have any type of situation like this in your life. But if... Oh, no! No, 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 no. Oh, but we can just take this. So it's actually not a big deal. Uh, <laughs> but I wanted to say, if you have or had any type of situation like this, or will have maybe, sadly, uh, like this in your life, oh, I, I can just do this. Then please learn from my experience, okay? Don't let anyone, and when I say anyone, I mean anyone, not your family, not your friends, not your colleagues, not anyone. Fuck you over. Okay, guys? Please. Don't let anyone disrespect you, be mean to you. If you did not do anything to deserve it, they have no right to do it. I am the type of person who tries to respect every single person. I think I'm going to castle queen side, yeah? Because, I don't know, it just feels better. Because um, here it's, like, pretty open. Uh, don't let anyone disrespect you, okay? Because if you, I try to be respectful to everyone that I meet, especially like in the first time that we meet, because you never know what somebody is going through. Oh, they also castle queen side, fine, copycat. Uh, but like, you know, if somebody shows disrespect towards you and you did nothing wrong, you did nothing to deserve that. Like, be disrespectful back. Tell them, fuck you. Tell them, fuck your mom. You know? Because why should you... Why should you be like... Um, oh my god, what's the word in English? Sorry, I speak like seven languages at once here. So it's kind of hard to remember all of it. Uh, I can give him a check. Uh, with 46 seconds again. So he's just doing this. I will trade this up. I'll trade it up, I'll trade it up, oh yeah. Uh, yeah, don't let anyone uh, disrespect you, because you know, at first I always try to be nice, and I always try to say nice things and smile at everyone, and be like, yeah, yeah, everything's good, blah, 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 and be friendly towards, oh shit, be fr friendly towards everyone, but, um, you know, with some people you just cannot do it, okay? Okay, guys? With some people, you just cannot. So, um, some people will be mean to you, and that's just what will happen. So, you have to learn how, st how to stand up for yourself, okay? Uh, please, please listen to my advice, because it's helpful, and it's going to help you with a lot of situations. Because no matter what you do, where you go, you're going to, um, you know, deal with shitty people, probably. At, at some point, you will, because that's life. So just, just try to, um, I have four seconds, I will lose in time again, doesn't matter. You know, try to be nice to everyone, but if somebody is not nice to you and not respecting and doing the bare minimum, then fuck it. Oh, I, I can't take this. It doesn't matter. I lost. I lost. Because I wanted to be inspirational. I want to help you all. I want to help myself. Chess is secondary on this channel, but I didn't tell you that, okay? Oh. Let's see. What was the position here? I think we were pretty equal. Literally that equal. Zero, zero, zero that equal position how was i supposed to win this how i don't know but guys yeah thank you for 
watching this video. I'm just joking. I'm, I will continue talking, of course. I always do. So these were the games. Hopefully you'll like them. I like the first one a little bit better just because it was more chaotic. Um, the second one, as you can see, dead equal the whole time. So that's why I don't have anything special to say about it and no special reaction. It was just like England Gambit. What can I do in England Gambit? I take the pawn and then after that I'm lost. So, you know, it was pretty boring. Just zero zero all the time because this person traded up everything. That's the most boring uh, gameplay that I know of, okay? Uh, but yeah, my message to you all today is definitely do not let anyone um, fuck with you and disrespect you and be mean to you and do not think that it's okay. Okay, guys? If somebody, for example, like the, the situation with me and the dishwasher today, when he started yelling at me and throwing things, not at me, but he started throwing things, which is a dis... That is disrespect towards me as well, because he was doing it because of me and he was doing it to like show me you're in the wrong, you're stupid, blah, blah, blah. So if somebody does that to you, you either laugh at their face, which is what I did today, or you ignore them, or you tell them fuck you, because that's being disrespectful. So do not let anyone disrespect you and do not think that it's okay. Those behaviors are never freaking okay doesn't matter who it is where it is when it is it's not okay those behaviors are never ever okay so when you see that somebody is mistreating you don't be like oh maybe i'm actually just overreacting maybe i'm actually in the wrong oh maybe they didn't mean it this way maybe 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 no maybe you feel disrespected they disrespected you okay i sorry for the headphone warning by the way but Disrespect should never be tolerated for nothing, for no money, for no reason, for no friendship, for no family, nothing. Okay, so that's the message from your chess doctor today, because I want you all to have the best life ever and to enjoy your life and to not have to deal with these type of shitty situations and people. So, you know, learn from my, not mistakes, but situations. So yeah, this is the video, this is the message. Hopefully you all have liked it. I really enjoyed it. I really love this little ritual when I come to work uh, or come from work or before work I film videos and I just have a chance to talk to you guys and to play some chess to laugh at the misery and the not actually misery more comedy of life and you know it's just funny because um, I really like that I can sit here relax and it's completely like my free time that I can spend in this such beautiful way uh, because I can speak to you all and I know that I will see many amazing comments. I can teach you all some valuable lessons from my own situations. I can teach some, uh, I can learn something from you as well. And it's just, it's just amazing. I'm very helpful. I I'm very grateful that um, I have this channel so that I can went here and that I uh, have all of your support because it really, 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 really <laughs> means the world to me. Because I, I know that I can rely on you all and that you all will support me and tell me like everything will be fine, fingers crossed, love your content, this and that. And it truly keeps me going. So thank you, everyone. Once again, thank you for 400 subscribers. It's crazy. Um, because when I filmed my first video, um, I was not expecting anything like this. I was just expecting to film a video for fun, uh, which I did. Uh, but I just continued making those and in every one I have fun and this community just kept growing which is unbelievable so yeah everyone those are the games this is the video this is the message don't blunder do, do not resign just chill take your time everything will be fine don't let anyone disrespect you once again uh, sub to this channel and like this video uh, if you like this video <laughs> and if you want to help us this out if you want to support buymeacoffee.com slash tapatsapetis for donations but if you cannot or do not want to uh, give out financially uh, then you can uh, support it as equally as uh, well uh, by subscribing leaving some comments sharing following liking this video whatever everything that you do is beyond helpful okay don't think like oh this subscribe button doesn't do anything it does so much it does so much 
So if you still haven't subscribed, but you like Zappa Zappetti show, then click the button. Add me on chess.com if you want to be friends and if you want to play some chess with me, of course. And if you want to chit chat, you can message me. I'm a very friendly person. I just scream sometimes at myself <laughs> when I lose games, but it's it's fine. And yeah, leave some comments, follow me on Instagram. You can message me there as well. And that is it. If you want to uh, stay tuned for this journey, then make sure to follow. Thank you for support once again. And I will see you next time. I don't know why I started singing fucking opera, okay? But it's fine. Thank you, everyone. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.